Hello everybody, this is Scarecrow. We are back with the Adventures of Horai High. Now, I've actually gone back in time. I've reloaded one of my previous saves because I realized that there was something I needed to do here. Uh, there's a character we can get, but we can only get it here while these students are stranded here. After you go to the jungle village and discover it, the next day, when you go to the ruins, if you come back here to the beach where the students are, I knew it, there had to be people living there. See, they all have different reactions now. We'll keep watch here for any boats. I want to see the village too, but I'm too scared to go to the jungle. We're going to go visit that village later. But over here, is a guy who was fishing. And he has caught a starfish. What the? There's a massive starfish hanging on there. Starfish Ron, oh god. <laughs> he is gross looking. Please, I beg of you, save me. Will you rescue the starfish? Yeah. Thank you so much. I came here from space to survey the planet Earth. I am Starfish Ron of the planet Starfish. I promise to repay this favor one day until we meet again. What on earth was that supposed to be? Was it a starfish that mutated in a freak accident and became sentient? No, he said he was an alien, Haru. You were talking about how you wanted to believe before, and now you just don't want to believe anymore. What's that about? Okay, well now that I've done that, I'm going to get back to where we were, and then we'll jump back in. So, see you in a moment. Alright, so let's go check on this statue. Oh, I think the hair is a little bit longer. So, did the hair grow? Hmm. Well, it almost kind of looks like it. I guess it's just a story after all. Let's check it out again in the new year. Okay, so we need to come back in January. Alright then. So that's that done. Um, I will go ahead and get back out of the girls' dorm and we'll be right back. Now that we checked out the statue and found that the hair grew a little, let's go ahead and move on to our other stuff. Okay, so Hinako said that we needed to check out Newtown and the side street. So we're gonna go do that at the moment, see if anything has changed. So first we're headed to the boys' dorm to get to the side street. There we go. Boys' dorm. Side street. Okay, so let's go here and talk to some people and see if anything has changed. Why are all the items so expensive now? Oh yeah, I, I switched the party around. D51 is now at the boys' dorm. What do you have to say? School festival? Intriguing? I would like to investigate. Do bring me with you. Sorry, D51. I'm not bringing him with me right now because he can't join clubs. So... Any experience I gain is wasted. I mean, he'll gain regular levels, but everyone else gains levels and club levels, which is important. Okay, you guys got anything to say? Okay, that's the same thing he said before. This place is known for its super big jumbo parfait. Hmm. Jumbo par jumbo parfait, you say? Heals HP, but... <laughs> oh, what's the but? Did it uh, affect you with something? You get a status ailment for eating a giant... You, you get brain freeze. Tummy hurt. I got hit with a bad case of tummy hurt. Shin? He's a class representative for the third year... For the third year, who transferred here a year ago. I have no idea how a guy like that got to be representative. He must have bribed someone. Okay, so we don't like Shin. Huh. Skin lotion's so expensive now. Maybe everything's so expensive because of the bad weather this year. Shin always treats us to all sorts of stuff, but how does he have so much money? Well, Shin is starting to sound very suspicious. Hey, you guys. You know that boys and girls aren't allowed to mix right now, right? Yeah, I don't care. I say, F the rules. 
house. I'm too cool for them. I'm in the houseboat club. Okay. What's this building? Hello? Oh, okay. That's that one you couldn't get into before. Excuse me? Stay away from black market items! Eavesdropping public safety guy outside. If it weren't for whole Rai High, we wouldn't get TV out here on this island. I don't know where I'd be without cruel game shows and cheesy soap operas. You and me both, man. You know this guy? He watches all kinds of game shows. Huge fan of MILF Manor. Because it combines both the game show aspect and the soap opera aspect. When you're hungry, try Robin Saburo's special ramen. They say it's been stewed for 4,000 years. Ramen Saburo, okay. This place may be a little dirty, but it's cheap and cheerful. And you get a lot for your money. Are you ready to order? Yes. Is this the special ramen? Or is this not Ramen Saburo? Okay, I tried it. Mmm, delicious. Quite salty. I haven't seen any students on dates lately. Did something happen? Yeah, there's a new rule. Can't intermingle. It's fine, you know. We're, we're, we're dealing with it. I'm running out the first floor to a Horai High student. Yes, this was that girl Akiko, right? Oh no, it's a different one. I'm staying here since it's close to the school, but there are plenty of- Okay, this is the same thing she said before. There's gonna be a lot of just <clears throat> wandering around as we figure out what's going on with this stuff today. Sketchy soup. This restaurant is Sketchy Soup, directly run by the cooking club. Okay. Can I buy something here? This month we have a special menu for on for the school festival. Oh, okay. Ah! Whoa. What? What? It, 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 it's... It's the A menu! So what? Is... It really rare or something? Who cares how rare it is? They say it tastes so good it feels like your tongue is melting. And on top of that, they call it the menu A of happiness, because the divine taste is guaranteed to make you happy. What? We've got to order some fast! You found one of the- What? <laughs> okay. You found one of the seven mysteries of Horai, the menu A of happiness. This doesn't really feel like- Whoa! 22k! Boost your strength when eating. Okay. Buy two of them. I got money. Does that mean it actually, like, physically, like, boosts my strength stat? He's at 263 right now, so let's try it. Oh! It pumps him up, too. Okay, it does not actually boost your strength stat. Looks like it pumps you up and fully heals you, though, so that's pretty cool. Alright, well, we found one of the mysteries of Horai. I'm glad that I did come here. I keep seeing you around here. If you're interested in food, why not join the cooking club? Oh! Huh. Okay. Healing items are cheaper. That's not super impressive. I'm not... I'm not dying to join that club. You can eat all sorts of great food in the cooking club, you also can put on weight. Yep, you said that before. Okay, well we found a mystery of Horai. So that's good. We're gonna take a look around some more, see if there's anything... Anything in this place? This is the other restaurant, right? Yeah. Okay, nope. Mama G Materia. 
bolognese. Anybody else here? Same thing she said before. Yeah. Okay. So it's mostly the same here. Except for small things that are different. And the Horai uh, wonder that we found. Let's see here. Go in this place. Trunk room. Okay, I do want to store some stuff. Because I am holding a lot of junk. Okay, I'll be back in a moment after I drop a bunch of this stuff off. Alright, that finishes up everything here in the side street, so we're going to make our way over to Newtown, because Hinako was also talking about going there. And after that, we can make our way to the sports ground. Okay, he says the same thing he said before. These high prices are going to drive me out of business for sure. Okay, that's new. Anything in the inn? Okay, I think that's the same thing she said before. Work our way up. Don't know if there will be anything here, but we gotta take a look around. Same thing she said before, same thing he said before, okay. The gender segregation rule? Come to think of it, Shin from the third year did just give a presentation about how brilliant he thinks it is. Maybe losing the election drove him insane. Yeah, my girl Mutsumi won. Do that transfer student likes to make okay yeah that's the same thing he said before. Let me open at night. Monitoring item prices. Okay, that's something new. Can I go back into the Mamajima building? Oh I can. Whew! I'm so busy today. What is Is there a reason to come in here? Hey, get out of here, it's dangerous. Well, at least there aren't fights here anymore. You can take a look around. I guess you might come back in here if you had left any items. Move it! Out of the way! Because, yeah, it looks like you can't actually do anything here. But maybe there is something if we go up. Or maybe there's a hint about the item pricing. Alright, I'm going to go ahead and spend some of these FP, because I'm sitting on a bunch of them. Let's see, these guys are all best friend level. Let's raise Adachi to best friend level. Oh, it takes so long to assign points. Okay, never mind. She gets a skill called Gamble, huh? There we go. I knew there was a way to do it faster. Okay. Uh, yeah, that'll put her over into the best friend level. And we'll just drop a bunch on D51 too, because why not? We're just gonna give him like 2,000 or something, that'll probably be fine. There we go. Is that reason to best friend? It did. Alright. Okay, so everyone's at best friend level. I'm gonna go ahead and drop some more points on Hinako. Because why not? Alrighty. Continue in this place, see if there's anybody got anything to say. Probably not, though. Actually, anything up here? This is the roof, right? Okay. Nobody up there. I'm not sure what we're looking for here in Newtown. But Hinako did mention it, so I'm taking a look around. 
Okay, yeah, it looks like you can't get anything here in the, uh... Mama Jima building. I didn't figure you could, but it's still interesting that you can access it during the day. Alright, go ahead and drop out of here and keep looking around. So that's all that. Check here. Okay, yeah, he's saying the same thing he said before. Only open at night, okay. We finished a games room underneath the shop this month. Try your hand sometime. Oh! Okay, this is new. Games room. Vote Mutsumi. Oh, oh, yeah, that's already done. Oh, this is where the coupons go. Okay. Oh. Oh, okay. So there are some. Wow, I don't have many coupons. I've only got 29. Some of these are 400. You know these items are amazing, right? They have to be like the best items in the game. Okay, so that's what the coupons are for. And I guess I can continue. It's been a while. That, left, that athletics festival ended up being quite a mess, didn't it? So the Junko Joust turned out to be very popular. So we made, a, we made it a regular event here. Oh, okay. And I guess this is the shooting game again. Okay, I understand. So I do have the ability to get coupons here. So we might do that sometime to, uh, you know, get some cool items out of it. But that is just playing the mini games we've already seen before over and over to get, you know, 400 coupons or whatever for the best item. You got anything to say? Okay, you're saying the same thing you said before. But up here. Oh yeah, this is that girl. I'm Akiko. It's a long story, but I left the dorms and live here. Akiko, you seem special. Do you want to join my party? All you're doing is just standing here and talking about how you left the dorms. Okay, so that was a new thing we found. The shooting, or the games center there. Anything else here? No, why is this place all dark? Why is nobody at the Yakiniku place? That's kind of weird to me. This is the fortune telling club? Yeah. Okay. Don't need that. Um, alright, I guess that's all the buildings here, except for the northwest section, so I'm gonna go through the sewers, and I will see you when I get to the other side. See if anything's different here. I feel like some of these might be different. Maybe they are the same as they were before. Card your bum bum. Uh, okay, Shrine Charm seems like a good thing to buy for a couple of these people, so we'll go ahead and buy one at least. I'm sitting here with so much money, we might as well buy some stuff. Okay, is there anything in here now? No. Okay. How about this building? Okay. So they're still talking about how this place is empty. I kind of assumed at some point some people would move in here. But maybe I have to find them. Or maybe it's just a later chapter. But yeah, okay, nothing in this section, so we're gonna leave here and then we'll make our way to the sports ground. Be back in a moment. Okay, so that's everything in Newtown. Uh, we've didn't really find much new stuff there, although I guess there's a game center. That's something to take a look at sometime whenever we need to get some cool items. Not really much else, though. 
Okay, they said to go south. Oh, I think I need to go over to that side, right? I'm not quite sure where the sports grounds are supposed to be. I think it's southeast of me. I said I need to go south along the tracks or something like that. So let's go up this way and around. Do, 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 do. Yeah, follow the tracks down this way. Probably. Get out of here, Ronins. You guys are so weak now. Not even worth my time. Actually, I might as well just apologize, because 46 experience is doing nothing for me at this point. Okay, there is a bridge here. Ah! I think I see a pool. So that's where we're going. Whoa, thug! This guy's new. Look at him! <laughs> He's looking for trouble. Came with his knife. Oh, well. He looks a lot like the other uh, delinquent character we met in the classroom building at night. Is there anything else around here? I want to take a good look around before we head into there. Oh. Huh. Forgotten students. I don't think those are the same as the... Oh, hold on. Okay, I thought that might be another entrance. It was very suspicious how that went in there like that. Okay, yeah, let's take him out. Come on. Get wrecked, dummies. Now these guys are worth a fight. We're gonna get some good experience this time. There we go, 586. That's what we like to see. Make our way over to the sports grounds, and we'll find out what's going on. This place, right? Hold it right there! Where do you think you're going? Hey you! You're not planning on sliding off to one of those black market shops now, are you? How rude. I'm here to see the Mad Scientist Club. Ah, oh, shit! So glad you could make it. We've been waiting. <laughs> this gentleman is class representative Shin. He is assisting us in our work. In fact, he's come to see the giant robot we're going to show off at the school festival. Invincible 22. He says he'll get the student council to buy it if it turns out well. <laughs> oh, you mad scientists are fun. Ah, fine. You can play with your toys. Just don't bother the other students. I wonder if the black market's on today. <laughs> That's such a funny way to end that whole situation. I wonder if we can go buy some stuff at the black market. What on earth are they segregating us for? Are they trying to turn us into machines? Oh, it's Crow. Lovely. Shin asked me to run a shop here. I'll give you a special price. Just because I love your stinking guts so much. Oh boy. Of course. Of course you're gonna charge me everything for this stuff. It seems like wearing it makes you smarter. That's a very funny thing for that TR to say. We'll go ahead and buy three of them. Scuba mask, sure. I got a lot of money, so even if you're overcharging me, it doesn't matter. I'll take two of these two. Hey, we're finally back at a, you know, reasonable amount of money. How about that? That's crazy. Alright, go ahead and equip this new stuff. Crow, auto. Oh, that mortarboard increases defense and academics. That's pretty nice. Get everybody equipped. Yeah, I think it's fine to do that instead of that. Hold up. Wow, that ponytail really drops your defense. I guess that was an early thing, wasn't it? Alright. Haru still can't equip any helmets. The guy just does not like wearing hats. Ever. 
The ATR is better than the ponytail by a lot. Mitsurin doesn't get anything new. Oh, uh, that's better. Oh yeah, I can probably get her a better weapon out of the junk I threw in the thing. You can't use the pitching machine, huh? Okay. That's fine. They're not really being used in my party anyway. Roku. Oh! Mamajima? I thought you got arrested! Taizo Mamajima. Welcome, welcome. Today all items are a steal at only three times the usual cost. Of course. Oh. Oh. Well, now I wish I hadn't spent that money, but, you know, I didn't have enough money for all this stuff anyway. Wow, okay. Can I only buy stuff now, or is this going to be available from now on? That is a good question. And I don't have the answer to it. Does this go anywhere special, or does this just leave? What? Is this building? Oh, weird. Okay. I guess let's take a look at this place. Um, <laughs> this is a very creepy building. You know, just an industrial building sitting there, I guess. I don't know. Seems kind of weird. I've been seeing people from the Mad Scientist Club at the sports fields a lot lately. I wonder if they're up to something. Ah, it's so cold! Can't the girls hurry up? We can't hold swimming practice together anymore thanks to that stupid gender segregation rule. I can't even go on a date with my girlfriend now! This new rule isn't like the whole I know at all. Can I go into this? Okay, I can. They're even keeping boys and girls apart during practice! What do they think they're doing? There's been a lot of small earthquakes lately. What's happening? I bet the earthquakes are related to the Mad Scientist Club making a super robot or something, but you know, we'll figure that out when we get there. People are getting stressed because of the new stupid rule and the price hikes, so fights, fights keep breaking out. That's why the health committee is sending out staff. Do you need treatment? Oh, okay. We'll go ahead and save. Save on this file. There we go. Hey you! It's forbidden for boys and girls to mix! I don't care. Why don't you stop me? You wanna try? It's not gonna work. Okay, well, what's going on down here? Oh! Tennis club! Used to be a club for lazy slobs, but whipped themselves into shape after being inspired by Anna Kornikova! Hmm, okay. That's counterattack for punch weapons! What?! get a counter-attack? I mean, that seems like a pretty good club. We'll probably join that at some point. I mean, Daiichi's running out of clubs to join, so we're gonna have to. Okay. Well, that's pretty interesting. So, is there anything else I can do here right now? Like, I saw Shin meet up with the Mad Scientist Club, but then they walked off somewhere. Okay, I got an idea. What if I... Move Hinako out of the party and move Isaac into the party. Now I don't have a mixed group. Oh, they don't care. Okay. Thought that might change something, but it didn't. Hinako, back in. Huh. Okay, well, something's going on here. Don't necessarily know what. Oh, okay. Earthquake. Eek! Ah, the mad scientist giant robot is out of control. Somebody save us! 
of course. We knew this was gonna happen. There are so many students coming now. Where did they all come from? Hey, a Twilight Penguin. This is such a long sequence for how goofy this is. Come on, get out of here. I'll take on this giant robot, don't worry about it. Whoa, maybe I won't. <laughs> oh God, that thing is huge. That thing's out of control? Shin, Shin, Shin suddenly, Invincible 22. <laughs> ah, that conniving little, he meant to deceive us and steal it all along. <laughs> curses, curses. I thought it strange that he contacted us directly instead of through the council. It's dangerous here, everyone evacuate. Curses. It's the Public Safety Committee. T time for us to make our getaway, old bean! Ha 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 If we don't get out of here, we'll get crushed by the Invincible. There's no need for anyone to worry. All the mad scientist giant robots are riddled with faults, so they always run loose. Now's not the time to be a smug know-it-all. It's supposed to be 57 meters tall and weigh 550 tons, but it seems a little light to me. It's obviously well it's obviously made of paper mache on the inside. Still, did it really just run out of control by itself? I know the mad scientist robots sometimes break during their fights with the gadget club, but this is different. Maybe that guy Shin has something to do with it. Hey, Beatrice! Does Shin have anything have something to do with Invincible 22's rampage? It's you host boat people again. This has nothing to do with you. Get out of here! Invincible 22 is heading for the committee center. Shin must be planning to hold the student council to ransom. Looks like you hit the nail on the head, Daichi. But what should we do? We can't let the robot run amok. We can't even tell if Shin's inside it or not. Airplane. Wait, I know. There! We'll commandeer that helpfully located biplane to get into the Invincible. Excuse me? Oh, that's what was going on over here. It was a hangar. Um, excuse me. We're from Hospo, and we'd like to borrow this plane for a moment. Hey, this one's still running. Everyone hop in. Wait, wait a second. What are you doing? It doesn't have any... It doesn't have any what? It doesn't have any what? Oh, no. Oh no, guys. I don't know about this. <laughs> we just we just stole the biplane. All four of us are going to ride in it? Okay. All eight of us, I guess, actually. I like that there's just enough runway here to... Oh, nope. Okay. <laughs> Come on. There we go. Right, right. Take off! Um... This reminds me of uh, Pilot Wing 64, where you have the the little biplane and you're taking on the big machines that run around and attack the monsters. Grow. The fuel tank's empty. Well, that would explain why they were concerned about that. Uh oh. Oh no. Where are we going, guys? Go to the robot. We gotta get into that robot somehow. Yeah, fly towards it. Maybe that. Maybe that's a good idea. Where? No, come on, dude. You're gonna crash land on this building, aren't you? Oh, oh, maybe? Oh. <laughs> oh, okay. Oh, oh, we just gonna let it crash land, huh? Whoa! No way. <laughs> this whole section takes place in the giant robot, huh? Alright. Is everyone okay? Looks like we crashed into the guts of the Invincible. Well, I know my giant robots. Oh, this guy definitely knows his giant robots. Look at him. You know this guy watches Macross. I'd say that the pilot's room has to be in the head of this thing. Okay, that makes sense. What kind of enemies are going to attack us here? Whoa! I'm going to wreck some machines. Let's go. Okay. Ooh. 
decent amount of experience there. That was like 700. All right, let's take a look at this junk. Nothing, okay. We're gonna take a look at our time real fast, make sure we still are good. We've got a little bit of time, so I'm just gonna move forward a bit and see what we can find. The blue monitors on the walls inside here show all kinds of stuff. Blue monitors on the wall, okay. Break all this down, get out of here you dumb robots. Got some more club level gains there. That's the people I put in the survival club. Oh, can't open that. What's up here? Second floor, okay. First floor. So, oh, I can't go back now. Probably gonna have to drop down from above somewhere. Okay. So we've got a bit of a maze going on here. Alright, cool. Grimoire Club and Karate Clubs progressing. See, I see some switches over there too. There's gotta be like a hole or something to drop down. Oh, okay. We got these little elevators. Got it. Get rid of them. So, oh man, they don't drop much gold, do they? That was only four gold? That's not good. I spent all that money at the black market. Okay, so I need to go this way. And hit that switch, and that'll probably open that door. Okay, take all that out. Good. Now we hit this. Yeah, there we go. Now we're starting to make some progress. It's always the same enemies every time. I guess the different floors might have different stuff though. That's been a pretty common feature. God, there's no gold. I need money, guys. I guess I probably shouldn't have bought all that stuff because the prices were inflated, but I also didn't know if I'd be able to later. So, I just went ahead and bought them. Okay. Pretty nice. Make our way up here. Invincible 22. Second floor. Um, this looks... Ominous, why is it flashing red? Chopper bot 88. I love it's got just a Gatling gun sitting out of the bottom of it. Oh, blue screens. Okay, there we go. Oh, new ones. Androids. Android B. Okay, they're not too tough either. Are they worth money? Nobody's worth money. Because they're all robots, and robots don't need money. I think. They're worth a lot of experience, though, so we'll be making a huge headway on our clubs. Fallen Blossom. Invincible 22 status report. All systems operational. Access denied to pilot room. Okay. Well, I think that is where we're going to end for today. So if you like this video, please like, comment, and subscribe. My name is Scarecrow. I will see you in the next video. We're going to take down this giant robot. See what's happening next. So, bye-bye.